Hello, my fellow stagnant souls subliminally stigmatizing steroids. Today, we were back with the high One Piece experience. So, if you're ready to dive into some sexy One Piece action, let's dive into it, boys. Chapter 121, I knew. And there's a horse just chilling on that hammock. That's a strong hammock, because as, as a horse girl myself, I know horses weigh 800 to 1,200 pounds. So, that shit must be made out of titanium or something, because god damn. Damn, that's a thick looking boy there too. He be he has that big boy tummy. So like that 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 hammy that be an industrial sized hammy. And like the fact that those trees are holding on to that horse, very impressive. Those trees have fucking just steel built into them. They're built different. Zoro's doing handstand push ups. We'd love to see it. We love to see it. Ow! <laughs> behave yourself. Do you really think someone like you can escape from the Baroque works? Doom, doom. Oh, rest in peace, my homie Usopp. L, El, El Bozo. Doom. <laughs> Even the one with thirty million berries turned out to be a loser. <laughs> that pays if him for what he did back to Weekski Peak. You pirates should have evolved yourself with our affairs. We've captured your swordsman, and your friend, and the other girl as well. You caught Soro? <laughs> well then you're doomed. You can still talk, even after getting a face full of my kick bomb. Bleh! Drop dead, bitch. Uh, <laughs> pathetic. <laughs> Luffy! <laughs> Die! Die! <laughs> Fool. <laughs> Luffy! Luffy! <laughs> Let's go, Miss Valentine. Who's up, crew? No. <sighs> you little swine. <laughs> Give up. The candle jacket I put on you is harder than steel right now. You're my prisoner, giants, and you're not even at its full strength. Not even that great strength can save you now. In your in your execution. You owe our victory. You let your guard down. Red Ogre. Don't glare at me like that. It frightens me. <laughs> Aren't you happy? Your long battle is finally over. So what if we won with the help of a human? Victory is still sweet, isn't it? No! Coward. <laughs> I'm the real winner here. Did you know that the bounty- Oh, but I'm the real winner here. Did you know that the bounty on your head's from long ago? The colossal sum of money is still collectible. You dirty! So that's what you were after, Mr. Three. We'll have her. We caught this treacherous woman. Ha! Huh, what cowardly trick. Planting a bomb in Mr. Doggy's ale? Doggy? I'd be dogging your mom, but like, his name is Dory, my bad. <laughs> ale? The hell I gave him! The hell? Oh, Dory, after all these years, wasn't the hell refreshing? Hey, like the nectar of the gods. Is that what it was, Dory, my friend? <laughs> you gave away my secret, big mouth. Candle luck. Uh. Mr. Five, bring me the swordsman and the girl. It's time for my extra special candle bar. <laughs> Gaggle up. Ooh. Oh shit, he's got a whole fucking theme park of candle wax. Damn, the whole BDSM theme park goes hard, kinda. You gotta admit, it does kinda go hard. How? Oh, oh, what? What is that? Vivi, I thought you were Luthufi. Yo, yes. If you mean Strat. I got rid of him. <laughs> oh yeah? <laughs> Experience my extra special candelabara, fools. Doom. What's with that spinning up here? Now I know how it feels to be a candle on a birthday cake. Doom. Flip, flip, flip. I can't move. My legs. He's immobilized us. I have a feeling. It's not because he enjoys our company. Something's running us down. Hehehe. <laughs> Savor it. My extra special candle bra. The waxy mist running down your heads will soon turn you into wax for greens. Not even the skill of plastic arts could create such a deferent for a perfect human figures. You'll be wax figures with real souls. Die in the name of art. Forget it. 
We don't want to be your stupid art. Bruggy, don't just lie there. Fight! He'll turn you into wax, too. You must have eaten all your vegetables as a kid, huh? It's no use talking like that. He learned such a truth a short while ago, without realizing it's when Dorley was hurt. <laughs> he slew him after a battle of a hundred years. He was filled with pride and started crying. You were weeping for your friend at your own stupidity. <laughs> oh, it doesn't matter. What you've done is done. You great fool. <laughs> no. From the moment we began training blows, I knew Dory was hiding something. You did. <laughs> and you didn't say you knew. Oh, don't lie. If you knew, then why didn't you stop the fight? I don't see any hint of mercy in your acts. Worm, you know nothing of duels in honor. You could never understand why I cried. A worm! You know nothing of duels in honor. You could never understand why I cried. You know nothing. He was a proud warrior who chose to fight despite his injuries. How could I shame him by refusing his battle? He was willing to suffer in order to fight. How could I dishonor him by showing him mercy? Doom. But now I know the whole story, and I'll destroy you with my own hand. I owe my friend that much. <gasps> the rumble, rumble, crick, <laughs> Mr. Broggy, noisy monster. Who's up? Are we gonna let them get away with this? Oh, no way. I'll get out of here soon as soon as I gain consciousness. <laughs> Are you too, Mr. Ba Are you mad too, Mr. Bird? <laughs> Alright then, let's go. Time to clobber these guys. And with that, me and the homies are out to clobber your mom. <laughs> Just <laughs> open that pussy, you know what I mean? <laughs> hey boys. If you like this episode, and if you want to see more of the High One Piece experience, and more of my sexy little face, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate y'all being here. Thank y'all for watching, and I'll see you next time, boys. Bye-bye.